Famous Fat Dave coming at you on an eating tour. Holiday foods, and it's Halloween time. When I think Halloween, the taste I want on my lips is candy apple. So I'm here at Metro Candy Apple Incorporated, where they make 40,000 candy apples every Halloween. I'm gonna go in and see if they'll tell me the secret, and maybe let me taste a few. Hello, Ray. Hi, how are you? I'm Famous Fat Dave, and I hear that you guys make the perfect candy apple. It came to the right place. So you want to teach me how it's done? Glad to. All right, let's go. So, Ray, what do we do? How do we get this started? Put the corn syrup in the pot. OK. It's going to be about 55 gallons of corn syrup. There's no way to speed this. You can't, uh, no. you just got to let gravity do what gravity does. That's it. Okay, sirrah, sirrah. <laughs> it looks like it's boiling almost. Yeah. There it goes. Then I'm gonna add, start adding the sugar. I'm gonna use about 80 pounds of sugar. I think it's got enough sugar in there? Yeah, we gotta do more. More sugar, all right. I'll add a little bit more, and then I'll let this run for let's a put, bit. Let's put more sugar in there, yeah. yeah. And this is about an hour process. Just adding sugar all day long. You only want to add enough sugar so it doesn't go over the I top. I see, I see. And uh, you really, the goal is to get that General Motors color, that candy apple red. Oh, it's this a number is the... 40 red. Looks like my uh, 57 Chevy. How many apples is this going to coat? Hopefully about 80 cases. 80 20 to a case, 1,600 apples. 1,600. I'm making candy apples now. The origins of caramel and candy apples are a little murky. One story credits a craft sales rep with inventing caramel apples in the 1950s. Whether that's true or not, what we do know is that for centuries, people have been preserving fruit by coating it in sugar. These sugary coated apples have become a favorite around Halloween, since the holiday coincides with the apple harvest. All right, Ray, so what's the next step in the process here? Sticks go in, they come around, they dip and spin. Spin, comes back up, rolls over onto the tray where the coconut is. That's, that's shaved coconut? So, Ray, once they come off the machine, they get up, they, they go onto this tray, and then what? The girls put them on our line, our I Love Lucy line. They go down to Wheezy, who's our packer. All right, Wheezy, I'm gonna do this. Here we go. One, got cat-like speed and reflexes. Good man. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you out on this line over here. Is there any way I'm gonna lose my finger doing this? No, no, okay. no, no, no. All right, here we go. Easy peasy, nice and breezy. Press it, press it, wait and press it, okay. Now I pressed it, did I ruin it? Do I have to redo that? It came out all right. Yeah, we have to redo it. I'm not as good at this job. No, come on. I'm totally messing this up. It's a little... There's a magic touch. You got yeah, the touch, right. Ray. Why don't we try to just eat our mistake? Eat my mistake. Oh, this is really good. Really good. That's the candy apple of my eye. Holiday foods, Halloween.